here, BM Pro Ambassador, and I'm just going to start running through some tech tips. And the one we're going to kick off on today is the Odyssey screen. A whole range of frequently asked questions that come in. This is really designed for you service guys out there to help you get through some of those little questions that you might get over the phone or something may happen in the yard. All right, let's dive into it. Okay, our next tech tip now is all about the battery and why sometimes you may see this here is depleted and down to zero, but if you scroll back into here, it's currently still got a, a suitable uh, voltage. Now, the big problem that we're going to see there is where people have decided to connect most likely an inverter or something else directly to the battery. And the problem there is that this unit here is not seeing all of the information which is being sent up from the BP35. In fact, the BP35, which has got an internal shunt, is not seeing all of the information because somebody has connected something directly to the uh, directly to the battery. So if they're going to do that, they need to install a product called a BC300 Comlink, and that enables them to be able to take the information that that device is pulling from the battery, so taking all the amps and the um, the voltages and sends that into the BP35, which then sends it up to the Odyssey here. So yeah, so our issue is here where this would appear to be empty, but we've got a volts left on the other side, and that's because we've had the battery drained by an external device. So you really need to get a handle on somebody's setup and what they've done. So if anybody is going to connect anything to the battery, then what they need to do is make sure that they install a BC300 Comlink so that that information comes through. Mm -hmm. 